Well, probably the single biggest concern we had was knowing that the value of our house had dropped. What sellers want is simple. They want to net the most amount of money in the least amount of time with the least amount of stress. To get there, there's two elements. One is the preparation, presentation, pricing, and marketing. I'd say that's 80% of it. Would there be anyone buying? The other 20% of it is what you do when you get an offer, and that's the negotiating. So whether it was pricing our house, or how many open houses to hold, what day of the week to hold them, what needed to be done in the house in order to sell it, I mean, all those kinds of things. He had a plan. Preparation, you know, knowing what to do, what not to do to get ready to go on the market. Presentation, do we bring in a stager? Do you have what it takes in your home that we can move things around and get it presented in the right light? Aaron, he knows the market, he knows how it works and how we need to also present our house. It's the pricing, huge component. Not properly pricing your home out of the gate can cost you thousands of dollars in the long run. And marketing, getting people in using professional photography. It's doing an actual walkthrough video, not just still pictures panned. Leveraging social media, it's doing QR codes. It's really maximizing the exposure that you're going to get for your home on the internet. Preparation, presentation, pricing, and marketing, very important. But even more important is once you get the offer, what you do with that offer, how you create a counteroffer, negotiating that powerfully on behalf of the seller. That is the difference between thousands of dollars and weeks on the market. He just did the stuff that needed to be done.